neckline that can be layered under. Um, you can see where it hits under the v-necks, but I'm even thinking under a cardigan or a blazer, okay? My problem is, sometimes in the morning, I don't know how to put it together. Yes. Is there any way you could help me figure Absolutely. out what I need to do? Um, what I'm going to do is, I um, I think we should pull pull the items, and let me actually see what you have, and then I'm going to create outfits. And actually, if you want to, do you have a, maybe your phone camera? You could grab a camera. Sure. Um, and, and so you'll have a, a history and a memory Sounds and you can have a set that up however you want. Good. So you, okay. you want to know what to wear with this in particular yes, as one item? Yes, Okay. Yes. Um, um, I'm going to see what you have. Offhand, I'm thinking, do you have like a chambray shirt, you know, like those denim kind of shirts? Those I, are very in. I do have one and it's okay. actually on my... Um, see, see, this is where the bright colors are working in wintry fabrics. Or, or this is even in between. It's not super wintry, but it's, it's pretty. This is actually a really fun combination. I love the orange together with, really? the, with the neutral. That is great. Okay. Um, and that can be paired, I think, nor, I think with the orange, with the, if it were black pants, it might look a little Halloween-y. But um, it would definitely would look great with jeans. And you could also go um, in the beige tan family. OK. OK. This is cute. This is cute if you have a vest over it, so you can see the sleeves. I don't know if you wear okay. vests. No, I don't have any vests. Okay. So I that's like a good idea. What color would you suggest for that top? Um, what color vests? Well, it depends what kind of vest we're talking about. Okay. Um, there were the furry ones, which I like a lot. Okay. Um, there's also menswear. There's, I mean, I see because of the gold, I could see something in more the brown um, kind of family. Okay. But I think probably a lot of things. It's, it's basically pretty neutral, so it could go with a lot of things. Okay. But That's my first thought is, is sort of like the brown family. Okay. Sweater. Okay. Oh, cool. Okay. So I'm just going to pull these on the side now until I see items to coordinate with them. And this one's kind of on its own. I do recommend, I love these thin hangers, and okay. I recommend if you could just get a closet full of them and not have the mishmash. Okay. Everything's hanging at the same level, and um, it works really well when okay. you have coordinated hangers. Great. That's good to know. Okay. So polka dots, very cute. Polka dots under the yellow is adorable. Oh, well, that's a nice combination. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. Um, just some t-shirts. Do you want to... Put all of your t-shirts together as an organization, all sure. your blouses together, and all your t-shirts together. Okay. So right now, I'm just going to put the t-shirt on the end. So for instance, do you need these big heavy hangers? These are more like coat hangers. Okay. So okay. you but might want to put these closet. in another closet and okay. keep these all, the, all these thin hangers. They're fabulous. Okay. Another... I feel it's like you're duplicating a little bit okay. here because look at what you have here. You have two yellow v-neck sweaters okay. and you have two really similar color orange sweater and, and orange cardigan okay. and it's fine if you love a color but just try to make it different enough so that there's a reason. Okay. Got it. So, um, right. so a lot of the same things. I mean, yes, because you have this one, I mean this is nice too, but you could Put the brighter one away for spring, or you could keep it out if you like it. Um, it'll go with a lot of the same things. I like with the polka dot. I do like this more with the golden one. Okay. Um, cardigans, yay! So you definitely like the bright color. You know, these printed brown blouses are actually great with all these cardigans. I okay. mean, although I, I think I prefer the orange better, but that works. This actually is nice. Not with these bottoms, <laughs> that's too much brightness. Okay, but this would work, and um, the polka dots work. So these are these are great sweaters. And see how the brightness, because it's a wintry fabric, it's okay. Okay. But you you don't want bright with bright. Got it. Okay. <laughs> it gets much. a little clownish there. Okay. Okay, and this is pretty. Um, it's a little bit springy, but you seem to like it. Um. I would put it back to maybe a charcoal gray. Okay. It, it looks. It actually would look lovely with a light gray also, but maybe keep that for spring and go charcoal gray. Okay. Um, we'll see what little tops. This I would just wear a simple because there's so much going on on the sweater. I would just wear a, a simple actually. If you wanna, because it's very sweet, you could actually layer it with 
um, one of the edgier oh, um, t-shirts, cool. which is really kind of I cool. Like that. And if you wear this with jeans, it's just a fun weekend thing. Okay. Um, probably this is more of a jeans thing, and then if you're going to wear it to work, you're going to wear it with gray pants, and maybe just a clean white t-shirt or tank top underneath. Got it.